What's going on today guys, it's Folks here, and today I just wanted to review this game called Tactical Intervention. It's sort of new on Steam. It's a really fun game, you should go check it out. It's for free, like you can play it for free of course. And as you can see right here, you can load out either a shotgun, assault rifle, or a submachine gun. And what's pretty cool about this is you have a haste mode sort of, where you can't really kill people at all at the first. It's like sort of like a 10, 20 second thing. You just go to your enemies and shoot them like I am right here with a shotgun in the head. And it's pretty fun, I mean... Like, you just do it for, eh, I'd say like 20, 30 seconds, and then like it goes out into the black. But I just wanted to go ahead and tell y'all this, because I know that somebody's probably going to comment in the comment section that it looks just like it, but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and pop up an image right here, and on the right you'll see um, a person using the M4 in this game, and on the left you will see the M4 used in Rust. Now, as you can see, they're exact same model, and uh, the only thing about different with it is probably just the hand. But anyways, get back to this game. I like it how it has this really cool like uh, thing in the middle. It shows you where you're, like it's sort of like the mini map on Call of Duty, but it's like a circle, and it shows you where your enemies are. As you can see with the red dots, and it shows the green dots are your, of course your uh, friendlies. So it's like the mini map, but there's no map. It's just uh, enemies and uh, friendlies, and um, you can actually heal your friends. This is actually something that that sort of fun. But a lot of your friendly people just like don't even, or a lot of your teammates don't even heal you. So it's sort of something that's cool in the game, but sort of not. But uh, anyways, I was not doing good with this shotgun. <laughs> I don't know why I used it for quite a while in the game. I actually didn't know that you could change classes while in the middle of the game. So it was like, what? Whenever I figured it out. But anyways, you can see there's this hallway right here. And I love this hallway. It was a pretty fun hallway. Um... I always went down this hallway and there would be enemies on the other side and I actually got the last kill right here you saw I just I just healed my teammate anyways each game is 60 seconds for just a normal uh, or 60 uh, minutes for a normal TDM and that's really long you would say but it's only 200 kills well actually that's pretty long too because in Call of Duty it's only 75 kills but in this it's 200 kills and after you get 200 kills of course the game ends and you go in a lobby now right here you can see me using the M1 which is a uh, assault rifle and it's fully automatic and uh, it's, it's pretty sweet. I used it in this hallway and this is probably where I got most of my kills at. But uh, I still don't know what the uh, thing on the bottom left, that little red bar, I don't know what that is. It's not your health and it's not like your sprint or anything. Oh yeah, I didn't even mention the sprint. The sprint is like the bars in the middle. You'll see it once I start sprinting. There's like little bars in the middle and uh, they go down the more that you sprint my teammate just died right there but uh anyway yeah you just saw those the bars in the middle right <laughs> but anyways this is a pretty cool game though that's all I really wanted to say about it if you want to go check it out check it out look it on Steam and uh, download it it's a pretty fun game and I will see you later bye bye